Here with the Grand Master Bozy on his What's good, Mr. Bozy? Everything, everything is good, man. Everything is good. How about you? Oh, man, I'm chilling, man. Yeah. All right, so uh, what went on in the gym today? Well, nothing about working on defense, you know, and a little bag work after the defense, you know what I mean? Most important thing in, in boxing is you know, make sure you know how to catch a shot or get out of the way of the shot or, or move, you know, get, get hit, you know what I mean? But everybody get hit, it's the way you get hit. You know what I mean? Is, is, that off, is that most often how knockouts happen in transition from offense to defense? You say my knockouts? Yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. A lot of times, yeah. Offense to defense, you know what I mean? Come off the defense and come right back with the shot. You catch the shot and come back. You know what I mean? You know? How, how often do you do that a week? Uh, like maybe once a week, you know what I mean? Sometimes two times a week. Because sometimes I do it, catch them with the hands, and then I'm just... Just slipping and moving and rolling without the hands. It's the same, same exact way we throw the punches, though. You know, when we catch, when we do it without, uh, uh, without the hands. Just moving your head and your shoulders and, you know what I mean, and getting out the way. Um, IBF Eliminator. Right. For your son, Jerron Ennis, Castillo Clayton. Right. When is that going to be? I'm not sure for sure what date it's going to be, but they said the 21st, but I'm not really sure. Because it might, it might be on uh, Charlo and uh, Cassano's uh, fight. Uh, we are, I didn't hear nothing, you know, that's concrete, but I know we fighting in May. Okay. But, uh, they, but they had up uh, that we fight the 21st. Okay. So that must be it. I don't know. What's your, what's your thoughts on the fight overall as for, as to become the mandatory of Earl Spence's IBF title? Mm -hmm. I think it's a, a, a good position, you know what I mean? And the winner of that is, is, a, is a mandatory for Earl Spence. So, uh, you know, whoever win that. But you know how politics play a big role in the game. So that don't mean, that don't mean necessarily we're going to be fighting Spence. Or, or, you know, whoever. You know what I mean? They do what they want to do. So you see what's going on now. So yeah. you see how they, how they moved um, uh, uh, Thurman, Thurman yeah. and... and took Boots' place and then moved Boots behind them. Yeah. You know what I mean? So that goes to show you that, you know what I mean, it doesn't make a difference who you are. You know what I mean? If they want you in a certain position and you're not signed with uh, 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 somebody that's running this, this show, you know what I mean? You know, you get the position they take, that you, I mean, that they give you, I mean. What can Clayton do that can make this a difficult fight? Have you watched much tape on him? No, I don't really, I only seen Clayton one time, man. You know, I tell the truth. You know what I mean? I only seen when he fought uh, Libanette. Mm -hmm. And that was a close fight, you know. I, I, really, I didn't really didn't know nothing about Clayton. And a lot of people don't know nothing about Clayton. And that's the reason why we didn't uh, we didn't fight him before, because nobody knew him. Mm -hmm. Nobody knew him. Before. We wanted to fight Delami Del because we were supposed to fight Delami before that anyway. Yeah, and so you ended up having to fight Chris Van Heeren. That's right. Because of COVID. Right. Yeah. So that's why I said, you know, he wanted to fight, so we... We took uh, the army. You know what I mean? You know. And now they, you see what they did with him. They moved uh, Clayton up to yeah. number five. Now. You know what I mean? But did, he didn't work his way up to five. You yeah. Didn't he, didn't he just fight a guy that's like eighteen and nineteen or something? Yeah, like that? Uh, something like that. Yeah. That's what I heard, but I didn't see. It. You know what I mean? Like I said, you know. And and like uh, uh Stephen Espinosa was saying, um, really nobody don't know too much about him. You know what I mean? But I've seen fighting. You could be, you look like you're a pretty good uh, uh, boxer to make. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Does so, does that make him a dangerous opponent if you don't know too much? Nah, not really. Not really. You know, we would have been with all, all kinds of styles, so you know, we be prepared for any kind of style, whatever he brings. You know, you know. I don't, I don't think he's, he's, he's going to be dangerous. You know what I mean? You know, I don't think so. I mean, you know. Probably be a good fight and never know. You know, I mean, anything can happen in boxing, so you know. What's your expectations for this fight? Who's going to go on out there and get the job done and, and we move on, you know what I mean? Yeah, if the knocker come, we we we're gonna, we gonna take it. You know, I mean we're not gonna look for it, you know what I mean? So, um, let's say I know you don't like to look past opponents. Right. Let's say everything goes as planned. Uh, should we expect him challenging for the IBF title this year or early next? A book? Yeah. Uh, this year. This year. I think this year. You know what I mean? If not early, early next year. If not early next year. Yeah.